Hello, everybody, and welcome to another edition of FYI right here on the Real Estate Channel. I'm Matthew White, and I'm pleased to have as my guest today in the studio, Stephen Jagger from Ubertor. Stephen, welcome to the show. Oh, thanks for having me. Now, the name Ubertor, where does that come from? It's a name we made up. Uh, best way to explain it is the, the term Uber is from German. Right. It means top or above. Tor is from the word Realtor, but you can't use the word Realtor. It's a trademark name. Huh. So Ubertor is like a super Realtor. Now tell us a little bit about what Ubertor, Super Realtor, does. Basically what we do is we sell a website system to real estate agents across North America that allows them to manage their website, add their listings, add photos, virtual tours, content, uh, you know, there's a blog built into the system, but it's just a way for them to get online quickly, easily, and uh, be able to manage their online web presence. So tell us a little bit about the history of how you guys put this together, how Ubertor actually was formed. Um, we started seven years ago as a web hosting business called Combustion Labs Media Inc. Um, we did businesses, combustion hosting. A couple of our hosting clients happened to be realtors, came to us one day wanting us to build a little engine that allowed them to manage their listings. Um, we, we ended up agreeing we built that engine for them so that they could upload their own listings to their website. Um, basically, the long story short is it, is it turned into what's called Ubertor now, where all we do is real estate websites uh, and, and software to allow the agents to manage their sites. We don't uh, do web hosting for non-real estate anymore, and it's just we're a software company now. Right. Well, it seems like you must have had a pretty keen eye to the future, because that truly is where the future of real estate's heading with all these agents. Definitely. Uh, the agents that brought it to our mind, actually Vancouver agents, the, the guys over at LostVancouver.com, um, they were the ones that originally mentioned the idea to us about, I guess, four or five years ago. Um, and we, we looked around, saw the need, and uh, built... Uh, you know, the first version of our software. Now, from reading your blogs, it seems like you guys put a lot of focus on Google. Why is that? Well, from a website point of view, Google controls the internet, really. Right. Um, and anybody launching a site needs to be paying attention to what Google does, what the requirements are, how you can, you know, do well in Google. So we built our system following, Google has what they call their um, webmaster guidelines, and we built our websites following those guidelines so that we can ensure for the most part, that the agents' sites will do well in Google. And if it's doing well in Google, usually Yahoo and MSN follow along. Hmm. So we, we put a lot of emphasis in that. And that, of course, helps the numbers, helps people get out there. Yeah, helps them gain exposure to their site, gain exposure to their, listing, which, or their listings, which is the most important. Seems like you guys are always ahead of the game when it came to realtor websites. Why is that? Like, how did that come to be? Um, we're a little bit unique in what we do. Uh, the, the real estate business or the real estate website business is very localized. Um, we happen to uh, power lots of sites from all over North America. So we speak to our agents in different cities and they, have, they all have different requests. Um, like our, our, for example, our New York agents are asking about, you know, they have doorman for a lot of the condos. We're downtown Vancouver, there's no right. doorman. Um, so there's, there's different, each city has different requirements or different words used for the same thing. So. Right. Because of that and because of our travel and, and we do get, you know, get to sort of boot around all over North America, we're exposed to the different real estate markets, how they work, terminology, what's new, what's coming up, uh, and we're able to use that information and implement it into our system. And it's, it's fun to travel. It is, yeah, it's fun to travel. Yeah. <laughs> now, blogging seems to be a big hit with a lot of the uh, realtors these days and uh, Uber Tours are behind a lot of that. Uh, how did that en end up happening? Um, we've been... We've been pushing blogging now for about two and a half years or so, pushing our agents to blog. Um, it, it ended up happening because we know, uh, you know one of Google's big things is quality content on right. a website. And you know, Google's smart enough to know if content is copied or if it's canned content. And because they're looking for unique and quality content, a blog was sort of a natural fit if the realtor would update their site um, with their day-to-day -day activities, who they are, what they do, neighborhoods. It's automatically adding good quality content to their site. Um, so it, it helps them out with their Google uh, or their search engine you know, abilities or search engine ranking. And it's making their site a lot more usable from their, from their end user and sort of humanizing who they are and what they do. So we rolled the blog into the system and, and have been pushing agents to blog for a while. Yeah, it seems like uh, you know, I, I know a lot of realtors and from working with this job, I've found out that uh, some are tech savvy, some are web savvy, some aren't, some are just getting to that stage. Yep. And it seems like you would get the software and all of a sudden be like, oh gosh, what next? I guess you guys would offer training as well? Yeah, we do a few uh, unique things. The training we do here um, where agents can show up uh, depending on how many are coming will depend on the location. 
Um, we have a, you know, a trainer that, that would showcase, it's usually one of our approved vendors would, would run through our system, how it works, answer any questions specifically as to what the software can do. Um, most part, out of the box, the software is very easy to use. We put a lot of emphasis on, on ease of use, right. so that your average agent, you know, brand new site can start using it's it right away. Not overwhelming for them or anything like yeah, that. Yeah, yeah, and then the, the training is more just to showcase what the product can do uh, completely, right? Because uh, sometimes people aren't aware of our, you know, random little feature that that's built into the system or something that they didn't, you know, care about at the beginning, but now they're interested in. Um, for you know, good chance the system does that. So the, the training works very well, but we, and the other thing that's really effective for us is we have a, a live chat system built into the software so that when the agent is in their control panel, oh. they can click live help, uh, one of our customer service people's on the other end, and they can ask their question and get a, a, a direct response. Now, uh, we here at the Real Estate Channel, even though unfortunately I was uh, too sick to be there, mm. uh, we're part of a meetup.com meeting you guys did, a meetup meeting, and it, it went very, very well. How did yeah. the whole meetup thing come about? And it's a great idea, by the way. Um, we've been doing meetups for about, I think, five months now. Uh, it was my business partner, Mike's idea to, um, it was, it's kind of, we, we, the original thought was kind of like a training, but not really, where, um, and, and that's why the meetup sort of philosophy worked for us, where we were able to gather our clients, non-clients, anybody, you know, that's a realtor, really, right. or, or real estate related, would show up to a, more of a social event, not right. training where we're dictating to them, it's just more of a, a social environment where they can communicate with each other, communicate with, with us. Um, you know, even when you guys show up, ask questions about what the Real Estate Channel is and what it does. And it, it allowed for more of a social environment for them to get their sort of technology answers. And we focused the meetups specifically on real estate technology. And it's worked really well for us to educate our agents on blogging, right. Craigslist, uh, Google, Anything to do with 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 really with technology. Plus, we'll bring in speakers, just like we brought you know you guys in. Um, bring in speakers that are technology focused. Uh, they have some sort of product or service that's that's uh, dedicated to real estate, and we'll bring them in to not only we obviously don't want them showcasing their product too much, but it's more meant to be an education to the agents as what's available, um, what's what's out there that they can be doing costs involved, benefits, all that kind of stuff. So for those that uh, have never been to one and are maybe sort of watching this and thinking of it, you can go, you can see a little bit of a presentation, you can do some networking, have a drink. It's pretty laid back. Yeah, thing, right? it's very laid back. Um, it's, uh, it's, we've been doing them at Kaylee's Irish Pub down in, uh, in sort of on Granville and whatever it is, Smythe. Right. And uh, it, it allows for, yeah, for people to sort of hang out, get questions answered, um, really interact. Yeah, easy going, like yeah. laid back, no business pressure type of thing. Yeah, there's always a presentation. We always put the agenda up on our, on our meetup site right. before so people can see what they're coming out to. Usually how we've done the agenda is we bring in a speaker for the first chunk of time to present on, like you guys did on video. Mm -hmm. um, and then the second half, as we've done lately, is a website review. Now, for those that want to find out more about you guys at UberTour, how can they get a hold of you? Um, best way to do it is go to our website, ubertor.com. It's uh, U-B-E-R-T-O-R.com. Um, you can phone us. Our phone number's on there, or there's the, uh, the live chat built right, built right into the system on our site so they can chat live with our customer service people. Stephen Jagger from Ubertor, thank you very much for coming on oh. FYI. Thanks for having me. Pleasure. Thanks.